welcome back to my channel in today's video i will be doing a get ready with me a glow up for 2020 i will show you guys how i do like my everyday like soft glam without well every day i don't wear lashes but i decided to include lashes in case i'm trying to be extra but yeah if you guys would like to see how i came up with this look then keep on watching so just to start off the look i will moisturize my lips organic savannah lip balm keep my lips like ready for the lipstick at the end and then i'm gonna moisturize my face i'm using the ordinary um natural moisturizing factors plus hyaluronic acid i really like this moisturizer it's hydrating but very lightweight the purpose i wanted to do this video was just to like show you guys like a glow up like my everyday like soft glam look that i've been gravitating towards lately a lot using a few of a few new products from colourpop i my like black friday stuff came in a while back and i haven't had time to like play with them and whatnot so actually i have played with a few of them but i just wanted to do like a collective like play around with all of it so i do have my brows on as usual i'm just gonna conceal under my brows and my eyelids just to prep it for like the eyeshadow and stuff but i will be using the this is the pretty fresh by color pop Hydrating concealer, so this is what I'd be using to like conceal my. Okay, now that we have the base like set, I want to start with eyeshadow. I usually gravitate towards like neutral colors, like colors that are almost exactly my skin tone or a bit darker, but I usually like starting with like a yellow base. I'll be using a new palette actually this is from Colourpop this is their Aha uh -huh Honey pressed powder palette it's like a whole yellow palette and it's so beautiful that's what it looks like and it comes with like nine eyeshadows don't you just love the look of a new mirror we are going to start with the shade Stinger and just put that all over my eyelid going to go in with O behave O B have and just put that like in my crease so now the next part is using now a flesh color tone going back to my trusty Morphe palette and I'm gonna go in with the shade right there like all over my lid sort of but where it's not like too dark what i started doing a few years ago was have a word for my ear if that makes sense so this year my words were discipline intentional and consistency everything that i want to do i want to have intention i want to be disciplined and i want to be consistent because i feel like with intentions then a lot of things are not like lost on the way for example like i want to be intentional with how I spend my money, I want to be intentional with who I spend my time with, I want to be intentional with what I put my energy to, I want to be intentional with what I create, I want to be intentional with like what I put out into the universe, I want to be intentional with what I want in my life. So just like overall intentional with everything that I do, put intention in like my relationships, my, my work life, school, just like everything in total, I want it to be intentional and I want to have discipline to be able to see something through without like giving up you know what i mean and to be consistent as you guys know i'm not the best in consistency especially like here on youtube i tend to like stray away a lot i'd come be consistent for like two months and then i've disappeared so i really don't want that to happen this year i want to be putting out at least a video a week or two maybe that was my intention for this January and I feel like I did that the first week but the second week a lot was going on. Like I did have the videos with me, it's just that I didn't have time to edit them completely. Like my last week was hectic, H-E-C-T-I-C, -E very hectic. Which I know I shouldn't beat myself up for those type of things, you know what I mean? But yeah, that's what the eyes look like, like I said, very minimal. My sinuses have been out of control lately, it's actually insane. I do not know what's going on. So I'm just going to put mascara in my lash line. This is the Revlon All-in-One Mascara. So 
So we are done with the eyes. Moving on to the rest of my face. So Colourpop had released like a new collection. It's called the Pretty Fresh Collection, which is a hydrating collection. It's it has hyaluronic acid and coconut water, I think. Yes, coconut water. So it's good for like hydration and whatnot. And you guys know hydrated means like glowy. So I copped the whole co collection like you guys saw earlier, the concealer. But this is the primer. And it has hyaluronic acid and coconut water. This is what it looks like. This collection, like in general, is so beautiful. I'm just going to be using a little bit of that. And it smells like super amazing. Now on to uh, the foundation. When I usually do like my day-to-day -day makeup, I started using like less foundation because I don't want to be like completely like blocking off my pores from breathing. So I was looking for like something lighter and then Colourpop came up with the pretty fresh tinted moisturizer which i was so excited about i'd usually just wear like concealer under my eyes and whatnot but i feel like a tinted moisturizer was very clever because it looks like foundation but it's not as heavy it feels like moisturizer on the skin and everything i got it in the shade medium dark 15w i usually use my hands but i really enjoy this product so much i've worn it a couple of times and both times that i've worn it I got so much compliments like i got so many compliments from it because my skin looks very like natural but my spots are like not as visible if that makes sense i would suggest if you're going out to put on some like spf underneath because this doesn't have spf unfortunately which i wish it really did because then it would have been all i ever wanted from like a tinted moisturizer i look very ghostish kind of i know but we'll fix that in a bit so we're gonna go in with the concealer next obviously just to conceal like my bags to set my face with the Colourpop no filter setting powder as you guys can already tell like I really enjoy Colourpop's products they are very affordable and a good quality especially like when they have sales and everything I I'd literally like spend like 5k or 10k and I get a lot of stuff all right the concealer is done dun, 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 dun. bronze up my face very lightly as you guys know i love bronzer bronzer is probably one of my favorite makeup products bronzer bronzer and blush so i'll be using the fenty beauty bronzer that i talked about in my favorites so now that the bronzing is done i'm gonna do my under eye real quick i'm just gonna go back in with the colors i used on my lid for blush i love blush as well sleek blush in the shade savannah sahara for me i feel like blush like ties up everything so as i wait for my lashes to dry we are gonna just set my face again with the ColourPop pretty fresh hyaluronic acid setting mist and this is what it looks like the whole collection is like a nice peachy color which I like. I'm just going to do this all over my face before I put on the highlight on. I'm going to use a highlight from the eyeshadow palette. I usually use a Colourpop one, but it's kind of far right now, but I will use this one. That is the beauty of multi-purpose products because you get mix and match. That is it. So we are next going to move on to lips. It's usually a nude lip. So what I'm going to use is a like a brownish nudish lip liner. And just like line my lips and fill it in as well. And then and then go in with my next soft matte lip cream in the shade Abu Dhabi. This is like one of my favorite nude shades and it is not drying at all. I'm gonna put my lashes on now. I think the glue is like quite ready. And that is it. So that's it, guys. That is the final like soft glam makeup look. I hope you guys 
enjoy this look i was so fun creating it thank you so much for watching i will list all the products that i used down below so you guys can check them out i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys